Today on JJ, we'll see a colorful tail that will make you see red. How do you like my new exciting color? You'll also see green and blue and orange and brown and oh dear. Next, Perky can't seem to get enough delicious donuts. Donuts! I love them! But wait till you see what happens when his appetite leads to horrible hiccups. The sun is rising high up over Terry Town. Friends taking off and friends touching down. And that's where you'll find that one of a kind. JJ JJ the jet plane That's me Never been another little guy like this So much in love with the sky like this So buckle up tight It's a magical flight With JJ 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 the jet plane Plane of a different color. Hey! I can see them! Here they come! JJ and Herky were very excited. Why? Because Savannah and Tracy were returning from a trip to the big city. Now, Savannah flew there all the time. But Tracy, this had been her very first trip. And since neither J.J. or Herky had ever been there themselves, they couldn't wait for Tracy to tell them all about her adventure. How big is the airport in the city, Tracy? Were there lots and lots of planes? Yeah, and what color were they all? Guys, guys, settle down. I can only answer one question at a time. J.J., the airport was ten times bigger than this one, and then even bigger than that. Wow! I saw about a hundred planes, all different colors. But there might have been a thousand more that I didn't see. Ooh! Wow! What about the colors, Tracy? What colors were all those planes? Herky, that was the most amazing part of my trip. I've never seen so many colors on so many airplanes in my life. <laughs> really? I saw blue planes and green planes and purple planes and red planes and orange planes and two-tone planes that were yellow and gold and black and white and... and... Hey, I love! A rainbow! Now I can show you all the colors I saw. A flock of birds to play. Oh boy! Imagine that the birds are really planes, though. Sounds neat. Flying, landing, taking off all day. Eat. Imagine every single one is different. Different sizes and shapes and flying different ways. Like me? I hardly can believe everything my eyes have seen. Even now, it almost puts me in a daze. Sounds like flying through a rainbow full of friends. That's right. Or zooming through a brightly painted sky. Exactly. Where they painted up at all the latest trends. Yeah, they look so cool I felt a little shy. Did anybody make a sonic boom? Once or twice. Was there anybody spitting while they zoomed? Not like you. To see some jumbo carriers or giant jumping harriers. Not so close, let's give the girls some room. It's like flying through a rainbow full of friends. An experience I highly recommend. So many ways to fly, so many colors in the sky. It's a treat to see how beautifully they blend. Brenda, Brenda! Oh, hi, Tracy. Welcome home. So, how was your trip to the big city? Oh, it was great. Uh, but... Uh... But what? What's wrong? Well, Brenda... I saw so many planes in so many different colors, and I started wondering, maybe I should be a different color. Hmm, a different color? Yeah, instead of purple, maybe I should be some other more exciting color. Maybe everyone would think I'm more special if I was a more special color. Gee, I've always thought purple is a great color. In fact, it's my favorite. But no 
one color is better than another, just different. Listen, if you're that unhappy with it, then I suppose we could try something new. Could we, Brenda? It just so happens that while you were away, I bought a brand new, super duper, handy dandy plane painting machine. It's right over here. I'll go get it. Aha, here it is. My super duper handy dandy plane painting machine. Oh yeah, I can't wait to be an exciting new color. Okay, Tracy, here we go. What's so funny? <laughs> the paint. When you're spraying it on me, it tickles. <laughs> there, I'm done. Well, what do you think, Brenda? Do I look more exciting? Hmm, you look just as much fun as before. Hey, why don't you go out and see what everybody else thinks of your new color? <gasps> That's a great idea. I bet they'll think I'm more exciting. <laughs> See you later, Brenda, and thanks! <laughs> <laughs> hey, everybody! What's going on? Hey, Tracy! We're just playing! Yeah! You wanna join us? Sure! Uh, guys, notice anything different today? Like what? I like something that's new and exciting? Uh, no. How do you like my new exciting color? Oh, yeah, it's really nice. Very nice. Hey, Tracy, Herky, a race to Farmer Sprout's barn down there. Wait for me, JJ. Hey, but I mean, aren't I more exciting to be with? Now, the fact is, to JJ and Snuffy, it didn't matter what color Tracy was. They thought she was fun to be with no matter what. But Tracy didn't realize that. So, once again, Tracy had herself painted a new color. Boy, I can't wait to show it to everybody. This time, I know they'll think I'm special. Well, hi there, Tracy, honey. Huh? Oh, uh, hi, Savannah. Brenda told me you'd changed colors. Why the long face, sugar? You look really pretty. Thanks. But nobody seemed excited about my new color. I think I want to get a new one. Oh, that's not a good idea, darling. Brenda told me the painting machine's been used so much today that it's overheating. You'd better give it a rest. Oh, but... Uh, but... Uh... Listen, honey, I've got to go meet Brenda in town. But cheer up! You looked great before you changed colors. And you look great in your new one, too. Y'all don't need to get yourself painted again, okay? Well, okay. All right, then. I'll see you later. Hmm. I'll bet that plain painting machine could do one more job. And this time, I'll make myself look so incredible that everyone will have to get excited. <laughs> forgot to gas up before I head into town to meet Brenda. <gasps> Tracy! Oh, sugar, don't tell me you used the plain painting machine again! Savannah, I used the plain painting machine again. Oh, sugar. I'm so sorry. You and Brenda were right. Now I broke it. And look what's happened. Can you help me? Oh, my. Well, I I'll have to go get Brenda to fix that machine. But since she's still in town, that could take the rest of the day. But what will I do until then? Oh, this is the worst paint job ever. Nobody's going to think I'm special now. Oh, this is terrible. Oh, I have to 
stay away from everybody. I don't want anyone to see me. I know. I'll take off and fly around for the rest of the day. Nobody will see me then. So Tracy tried to be alone in the sky. The problem was, the sky was pretty busy that day. Hi, Tracy. What's new? Not much. Hey there, Tracy. What's cooking? Huh. Hey, Herky. Well, hi there, little girl. My, you look nice today. Mm, thanks, Oscar. Well, so much for hiding out. Gee, I just realized. Nobody said anything about my ugly coat of paint. There you are, Tracy. I've been looking all over for you. Where have you been? Oh, JJ, I've been hiding. I didn't want anyone to see me like this. Like what? Don't you notice the icky color that I am now? Mm, it's not so nice as the ones before, but so what? You mean you don't care about it? Of course not. Why not? Well, um, I guess it's because no matter what color you are on the outside, all that matters is you're my friend, Tracy. That's all I care about. And I think that's all anybody else cares about, too. <laughs> really? You know, JJ, I never thought of it that way. Well, you should, because we all think you're the greatest. Oh, gee, thanks, JJ. Okay, Tracy, the plain painting machine is fixed. Now what color would you like to be? The best color of them all! Gee, I wonder what new color Tracy's gonna be this time. Maybe it's gonna be orange or green with blue stripes or... Ta-da! Purple! Oh, yeah! <laughs> Guys, I guess I've learned my lesson. When it comes to my friends liking me, my color doesn't matter. And from now on, I'm never gonna worry about my color again. Hey! Wanna go chase the rainbow? Yeah! yeah let's tell go! Me. Right now, I'm imagining that we're singing a song about... Imagination. See if you can help make my dreams come true. Ready? We hold the key. Hold the key. To be. To be. Anything that we want to be. There's a thought. There's a thought. We've got. We've got. We make it happen naturally. With our imagination. Look what we can do. I'll become a pirate. Yeah. Up havoc. It seemed like it was going to be a normal day in Terrytown Square, but as quiet as things were, soon there was going to be big trouble. It all started here at Andy's Donut Shop, where Herky and JJ had just finished a tasty donut snack. Boy, oh boy, am I stuffed. I don't think I've ever seen anybody eat as many as you, Herky. Doesn't it make you feel sick? No way, JJ. I love them. Can't get enough of them. Even when I hear their name, I go all rubbly bubbly all over. What? When you hear the word donut? Donut? See, all you have to do is say that word. Do you mean to tell me you do that every time you hear the word donut? Donut! Scrub, 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 scrub. Yeah, I do that every time I hear that, you know, 
word. Wow, that's funny. <laughs> what was that? I don't know. <laughs> there, you did it again. <laughs> and again, and again. And, <gasps> Herky, do you know what you have? No. <laughs> what? You have the hiccups. Oh, <laughs> no. <laughs> Not the <laughs> hiccups. It probably came from eating too many, do uh, you know what. <laughs> What's happening? What's happening? What's happening to me? A little while ago, I was as happy as could be. But something now is jumping wow way down inside my gears. Whatever it may be, I hope it won't go on for years. Sneezes I can handle in a second, they are gone. A burp or two can get a laugh, at least if we're at home. Even if I have to, I can bear a bunch of coughs, but I've got to find a button that will turn these hiccups off. <laughs> What's happening? What's happening? What's happening to me? A little while ago, I was as happy as could be. But something now is jumping way well, way down inside my gears. Whatever it may be, I hope it won't go on for years. They ought to call them hicking backs or hicking downs, I'd say. Cause besides just hicking up, I'm hicking every other way. If I were picking where I'm hicking, I'd be hicking my way home. Seems I'm in an endless hiccup room. How does this condition come from eating you know what? When will this bump and thump and tummy jump and stop? Whatever now is jumping wow way down inside my gears. I hope it won't, hope it won't, won't go on for years. <laughs> This is terrible. How can I get them to stop? We better get back home and see if Brenda can help us. So, JJ and Herky hurried back to Terrytown Airport to find help. And they almost made it until... Hang on, Herky. We're almost home. Herky? Where'd you go? Oh no, I've lost him. Herky! Herky! But it was too late. Herky was gone. JJ looked all over for him, but he couldn't find him anywhere. JJ was worried, so he decided to go home and get some help. Brenda, it's an emergency! Brenda, where are you? Hi, JJ. Snuffy, have you seen Brenda? She and Tracy and Big Jake and Savannah all took off for the cherry tree lane. The only ones here are me and Oscar. Why, what's the matter? Herky's got the hiccups, and he's hiccuping all over the place, and I don't know what to do, and now he's gone, and I don't even know where he is. Oh, my, that is bad. I had the hiccups once. Really? How did you get rid of them? Somebody said hiccups go away if you drink ice-cold water. So I tried that. Well, that sounds like it might work. Now, if only I had a way to tell Herky to try it. Why don't you call him on your radio? <gasps> of course! My radio! I got so worried, I forgot all about it. JJ to Herky! JJ to Herky! Come in, Herky! <laughs> I read you loud and clear! <laughs> I'm out of control, JJ! Where are you? I'm hit up all the way to Frosty Pines! He's at Frosty Pines? Wow! Listen, Herky, maybe that's a good thing because you have to get a drink of ice cold water. I do? Why? It might make your hiccups go away. Well, I'll try. Herky, are you okay? Yeah, I just had to get myself into position. Where are you now? I had to lay 
and I'm right at the top of a big snow slide. One more hiccup and... <gasps> yeah! Turkey, what happened? I fell into Lake Frosty. It's freezing. Oops. Uh, are your hiccups gone? Hey, you know what? I think they are. <laughs> or maybe not. <laughs> Herky, you've got to bring yourself home. Okay. <laughs> I'll try. I think I'm getting the hang of how to fly like this now. <laughs> I'm on my <laughs> way. <laughs> Some of these delicious cherries I just picked up. Brenda, you're back. Boy, are we glad to see you. Why, what's up? Herky's got the hiccups, and he's stuck in Echo Canyon, hiccuping himself silly. Oh, no. I've got him on the radio. Do you know how he can stop his hiccups? I sure don't. I've never had a case of hiccups in a helicopter before, but I know somebody who might have the answer. Who? Ooh. Oscar. He knows all kinds of things like that. Of course. Why didn't I think of that? Thanks, Brenda. Come on, Snuffy. Let's go find him. Hiccups? Well, as a matter of fact, I do know something about hiccuping helicopters. But why didn't you come to me right away? Gee, yeah, I don't know. I guess I got so caught up in Herky's problem that I didn't think about it. Well, youngster, I know that you were worried about your friend, but remember, when somebody's in trouble, you have to get a grown-up and tell them right away. You understand? I do, Oscar. Okay. Me too. That's good. Now put me on the radio with Herky. <laughs> Herky, uh, this is Oscar. Can you hear me? I hear you. <laughs> Now, first of all, I need you to relax. I... I can't relax. Well, this isn't good. I, I can't help him if he won't relax. We have to find a way to calm him down. JJ, do you think of any way that we can do that? Uh, let's see. Is there any way to make Herky relax? Hey, I just thought of a way. Herky, listen to me. I'm going to say a word that will make you relax, okay? <laughs> okay! <laughs> the word is donut. Did you hear me? I said donut! Donut! Okay, Herky, are you relaxed? I think so. Okay, good. Now, listen to me. I want you to take a deep breath. <laughs> okay, now hold it. Hold it in. Okay, now let it out. <laughs> well, young fella, are they gone? Hey, yeah! My hiccups are gone! <laughs> Great! Okay, Herky, now you can come on home. Herky? Are you there? Sorry, JJ, but before I come home, there's something I've just got to do. What's that? I'm hungry again. I've got to go to Andy's, do I mean, Andy's you-know-what shop to eat some more you-know-whats. What? No, Herky, no, no! Thanks to his good friends at Tarrytown Airport, Herky's hiccups were gone. Herky, don't! And he flew happily back to get his favorite snack at the donut shop. Donut? Scrub, 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 scrub! Can you name one?
one thing that has all the colors in the world? That's right, a rainbow. Now let's sing a rainbow song. Color me red, color me red, color me blue, color me blue, color me a rainbow, color me a rainbow, just like you. Now you're singing, Snuff. Color me pink, color me pink, and purple and green, and purple and green. Every color you can think of, every color you can think of, and even in between. Yeah. To fly away with JJ and all of his friends at Terrytown Airport, join us at pbskids.org for takeoff. Why do things fall? Well, it's something called gravity. When planes take off, they push away from gravity. And everything that goes up must come down. <laughs> That's why, no matter how high my little planes fly, they always come home, down here, right where they belong. Gravity. Think about it. Do you ever think about the weather? It can be warm and sunny, or wet and rainy, or really, really windy. For an airplane, it's hard flying in snowy weather, or in windy weather. On a nice day, Snuffy can make his sky pictures. How does the weather affect your day? Think about it. Now, here's something we need to think about. Rocks. Not all rocks are the same. See, this one's brown, and this one's black, and this one's smooth and shiny. Rocks can be little or really, really big. But the biggest rock of all is the planet Earth. That's right. Our planet is really a giant rock floating in outer space. Rocks. Think about it. Let's think about how things change. A little caterpillar changes into a beautiful butterfly. Leaves that are green in the summer change to other colors in the fall. The water in Lightning Bug Lake changes to ice in the winter. Even people change. See this little girl? It's me. That's what I look like when I was little. See how I've changed? How will you change when you grow up? Think about it. Teletubbies are ready to play. Are you? In just a flash, you'll be in Teletubby land. Lollipop! Don't just sit and snooze and snort. Go outdoors and be a sport. Baseball, football, basketball, beach ball, soccer, try them all. Ice skate, skateboard, roller skate. Fling some frisbees, bowling's great. Swing a paddle, swing a racket. Juggle stuff or hacky sack it. Ride a bike or take a hike. Jog or do a dance you like. Average size or tall or short. Anyone can be a sport. PBS Kids! <laughs>
PBS Kids is made possible by your support of your local PBS station. Teletubbies was made.